Welcome to another flipped classroom tutorial where I will share quick tech tips with you on educational technology. Now today I am going to show you how you can create multiple copies of a single document in Google Drive. Now this is often very helpful and useful when you have multiple report cards or documents that you want to create copies of but you do not want to manually right click on each individual document and make a copy. Now the way to do this is by using a simple script. Now the script I'm going to use was created by Alice Keeler and if you like the script do visit her website, it's alicekeeler.com for many more scripts. Now the document I want to copy is in front of you right now and as you can see it is a simple Google Doc. Now the script I need you can find here tinyurl.com slash copydocscript and let's go ahead and open this script. So. What this is going to do is it's going to open a website where I can create my own copy of this script. So go ahead and click on File, Make a Copy. Once you've created your very own copy, you can change the code in this script. So go ahead and close the original file. And let's call this Copy Doc. And then My Version. My Version. I'm going to click OK. And now there's two important things. There is the number here, which says I smaller than 30. This 30 stands for the number of copies you would like to have. So let's say I want 20 copies of this file. I change 30 to 20. And then down here you will see the ID of the file. Now this is what's going to point the script to the correct file. So let's go and find out our ID. So as you can see I have a folder here and inside this folder I have my example report card. When I open this report card you can see that in the URL at the top there is an ID. So you can see here this highlighted right now is the ID I need. So I'm going to go ahead and right click copy and I go back to my script and I place my ID right here. Now because this original file is already within a folder, all the copies will be created within that folder. So let's get ready to run this script. Go ahead and play, click on Run. And it's now saving it. Now the first time you run this script, as you can see, you will have to click on Continue. Allow this app to run. We are going to give it permission to run. Allow and I am now going to open the folder so you can see exactly what happens. This is my original folder and the script is now creating copies in the background. Now this will take about a minute or two to create all these copies. Once finished you can go ahead and rename these documents. Now let's go ahead and open a copy so you can see that this will look exactly the same as my original file. And here we go. I hope this was helpful. If so, please do click below and subscribe to the channel. Otherwise, go ahead and watch some of the other videos available and I will be back soon with more videos. Thank you for watching.